today's mass readings february 18 2020 tuesday of the sixth week in ordinary time first reading a reading from the letter of saint james james chapter 1 verse 12 to 18 blessed is he who perseveres in temptation for when he has been proven he will receive the crown of life that he promised to those who love him no one experiencing temptation should say i am being tempted by god for god is not subject to temptation to evil and he himself tempts no one rather each person is tempted when lured and enticed by his desire then desire conceives and brings forth sin and when sin reaches maturity it gives birth to death. Do not be deceived, my beloved brothers and sisters. All good giving and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights, with whom there is no alteration or shadow caused by change. He willed to give us birth by the word of truth, that we may be a kind of first fruits of his creatures. The Word of the Lord Responsorial Psalm Psalms chapter 4 verse 12 to 13 a 14 to 15 and 18 to 19 Let our response be Bless the man you instruct, O Lord Bless the man whom you instruct, O Lord Whom by your law you teach Giving him rest from evil days Bless the man you instruct, O Lord for the Lord will not cast off his people, nor abandon his inheritance. But judgment shall again be with justice, and all the upright of heart shall follow it. Bless the man you instruct, O Lord. When I say, my foot is slipping, your mercy, O Lord, sustains me. When cares abound within me, your comfort gladdens my soul. Bless the man you instruct, O Lord. Before we proceed, it would mean a lot if you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. Please don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos. Feel free to share your comments, suggestions and reflections on the comment section down below. Thank you and God bless. Now, let's continue with the video. Gospel Reading a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. Mark chapter 8 verse 14 to 21. The disciples had forgotten to bring bread, and they had only one loaf with them in the boat. Jesus enjoined them, watch out, guard against the leaven of the Pharisees, and the leaven of Herod. They concluded among themselves that, it was because they had no bread. When he became aware of this he said to them, Why do you conclude that it is because you have no bread? Do you not yet understand or comprehend? Are your hearts hardened? Do you have eyes and not see, ears and not hear? And do you not remember? When I broke the five loaves for the five thousand, how many wicker baskets full of fragments you picked up? They answered him, Twelve. When I broke the seven loaves for the four thousand, how many full baskets of fragments did you pick up? They answered him, Seven. He said to them, Do you still not understand? The Gospel of the Lord. 